Good morning, you guys. Good morning. Chris and I are stopping at the gas station real quick before we head to the cruise port, Port Canaveral. I wanted to stop at Starbucks on the way, but I didn't have time. So I'm looking here at the coffee section. What'd you get? A Coca-Cola? I already had a cherry Coke, <laughs> but I want more. I need more caffeine. The cruise port is about an hour away. We're gonna go straight there. We're parking off site. Chris made reservations somewhere and we'll tell you about it when we get there. So let's get on the road. I'm so excited. It's been almost two years. It's 920 and we're at historic Coco village. I've never been here and we can't go and we get off the cruise, but we're going to come back when we go on our next cruise. We're hoping to do a Disney cruise next month. But look, Chris just saw that pirate store and museum here on Brevard Avenue in Coco. With the magic shop. Yeah, you guys get off the cruise. You should come here. There's so many cool I totally things. I thought that said sand and sex. <laughs> <laughs> sand and sea. But the A looks that's, that's a that's a, um, that's a beach name for an adult <laughs> store here at Coco Beach. <laughs> sand. There's a wine bar. There it is. Sand and sex. Gifts and gallery. I'm joking. Sand and sea. I'm sorry if you're the owner of that store. Might get you more visitors though. <laughs> oh, but I forgot to tell you why we're here. We're here because Chris needs to run to the pink. So we're still in Cocoa Beach, but now we're going to Publix. Um, Chris used the ATM there, and I'm going to use the ATM here, and he's going to get... Wine, because you can each have one bottle of wine to carry on to the cruise ship, but it has to be in your carry-on luggage. On Carnival Cruise Line, you can also bring cases of soda. You can bring one case per person, and that's each person, your whole family. So everybody, when you go on Carnival, you see like every single person carrying their case. It has to be on carry-on or in your hands. And $5 for 12 you know, even six dollars for twelve sodas. When you get on the ship, last time I went, they were at least three dollars. Yeah, with tip added, they do add the tip, the cachuti to it, like three dollars a soda. And you're like, oh, three dollars not bad here and there, but that's twenty one dollars if you get one a day for seven days, where you can just bring your own if you have the space and all. So we're at the wine. Do you know what kind of wine you wanted? Are you looking for anything specific or something on sale? Or I want a good wine that I actually enjoy, mm -hmm. not one that is on the cruise ship. Yeah. So oh, I'm something you can't get there. Right, and they, I don't want to spend an arm and leg, but you will see some good wine tonight. Okay, I'm so excited. So, we got a surprise. <laughs> Do they still charge the corky fee here for $15 a person? Uh, only if you take it into the uh, into the restaurant. Oh. So, this is wine that you can be able to drink in your cabin. You get a glass from the bar, a wine glass from the bar. Yeah. Take that to your cabin, fill it up, and then you can still walk around the cruise ship. They're not going to know idea. what wine is what. I so. guess I didn't realize that because I had never taken wine on a carnival. But mm -hmm. on Norwegian, when you take your bottle of wine, when you get on the ship, they just charge you $15. Like they give you a ticket. I mean, that was when I went. But um, so you do buy your wine here and then you pay 15 there. It might be called an uncorkage fee, but even if they don't have to uncork it, if it's twist off or whatever, it's just you're paying $15 to bring the bottle of wine on. But Carnival, they don't charge you to bring the bottle of wine on. So that's gonna save you $15 a person. And of course, you have to be over 21 to bring the wine on too. You guys can't bring boxes on and it does have to be 750 milliliters or smaller. And this brand is my favorite. There's one called Freak Show that I love. I kind of want to try this one. I don't know, what do you think? Le Fat Bastard. <laughs> it kind of sounds fun, but I don't know. I do know that I want my favorite, which is Petit Petit. Chris, you guys, I haven't, it, when I just showed you what I just showed you a minute ago, and then I went to the bathroom, and then I came back and Chris is doing his wine. Chris doesn't know either. I just, on video, I just went to that wine and said this is my favorite brand and i love the freak show and then i came out and he has that so it's good and we didn't even know that either of us was going to say that and that's my son's favorite too trevon the petit actually... petit in the freak show and is that a dollar heck yeah, yeah dollar off we are at the off-site parking that i mentioned earlier park port canaveral there's the phone number it's 10 16 the shuttles run every 30 minutes so we're going to be here and have time to catch the 10 30 shuttle and by the way, there are all the cruise ships that we are about to go see. I hope you're just as excited as we are. <laughs> but I need this. She needs her sea, her sea tentacles. Okay. Gave Chris his Christmas slash birthday present and he wants to take it, which is perfect because it's Ursula and she gets to see the sea. She has to go. He's like, I'm not take, I'm not leaving her. No. <laughs> There's a shuttle uh, loading place over there with the luggage drop off. Here it's $8.95 a day, and at the port it's $17 a day. So all together with when they add on the taxes or whatever they else they add on, it saves us about $50 total for the six day cruise. Um, and since this is right by the cruise port, it's gonna be super convenient and everything. You know, if you're splitting the cost, so you're saving $25, I'm saving $25, Chris is saving $25. 
but if you're like in Miami when we did the offsite parking that one time and you had to go downtown and, and go up to the parking garage and, and wait for lots of shuttles, you might think, hey, it's not really worth $25 to me. So just, you know, it's an option. But today we, we wanted to do offsite parking because we wanted to save $25 each. You ready? You got everything? Yeah, we're gonna go get in line for the shuttle then. This is sodas. Oh yeah, that's the sodas. And the wine, right? And the wine, yep. <laughs> Two cases of soda and a wine. Oh, I need my luggage. God, don't. <laughs> <laughs> I just gonna leave the car door open and leave my luggage. I got my regular suitcase with my clothes and stuff. And then this is my um, electronics, like my computers, all my stuff for vlogging. Can I have it? <laughs> you can have that. I, just be careful, I, right? Okay, thank you. Like a big sticker of wine <laughs> inside. Yeah. So they Different put your, your luggage in here. No, That's nice. The they have a place for your luggage, and there's the uh, shuttle. Oh my gosh! Oh, I'm so excited! So we're on the shuttle and they're going to a lobby of a hotel to pick up eight more people and then we're going to be right at the ship. We're at the port, you guys. We're at the ship. He says that we have to all... We have to all stay on the bus until they finish unloading all the luggage. It's the rule. It's the port's rule. He said it was a port's rule. Yeah, it's port rule. And then also, he said that if you don't have luggage tags on your bag yet, like we do, don't. We don't. We have to get them. Because I don't have a printer. Anyway, we Same. can get them and I'll show you how in a minute. But if you leave a luggage here and go inside to eat on the ship and you don't have a tag on it, he says they have to take it back with them. But they're not going to put on the ship. So if you leave your luggage here, you're not going to get it. Unless it's March. I make sure it's March. Oh my God. Also, the shuttle guy, when he was talking about the luggage, I, I had a feeling to turn my camera on. I should listen to myself. He goes, Don't worry. Your, what do you say? Your wine? Your, wine will, your bag of wine. Your bag of wine will be okay. And then he was like, if you have wine or champagne, but I know he was talking to you. I know, because I was so worried about the bag of wine. I can't believe it. I've been dreaming about this for two years. <laughs> and I've only been dreaming about it for 20 days. 20 days? Because okay. this man well, here... Wait, when was the last time I did my cruise was... January 3rd. Through the 7th. <laughs> Today is the 23rd. Two, two weeks. I had two weeks between. He's been off the ship for two weeks, and then he went on another one before that. That, that was a little longer. But still, wait. this is his third was, one in yeah. six months, okay? My third one in three months. In three months, excuse me. This <laughs> is one a month. Uh, right there. <laughs> yep. We are um, getting ready to take our luggage for the porters, which is something here at the port. Uh, you would leave your luggage if it's marked. Ours doesn't have tags, so we need to get tags. Okay, my carry-on. He's putting tags on our bags right now. Okay, so you guys, you give him your bags. You have it tagged. It's ready to go. Make sure. I wouldn't just put one staple because they come off. I know they make carriers and stuff that are a good idea because somebody did fall off in here and the guy came back and said look your tag came off anyway but i'm so, checking my one bag just, just this one i'm going to check that one yeah one. and i'm going to take this little one and there goes the shuttle look you guys we're walking past all the luggage people checking their luggage here we're but going around the much. corner yeah this is it this is usually so much it's 11 about 11 and uh we're going to go around the corner to see a view of our ship if we can see it before we get on it take a picture so we took pictures over here you can see carnival magic i put on instagram like i said it's c underscore cruisers it is in my link below oh he has his carnival conquest cruise ticket in his wallet um we're getting ready to get on i will give you an exact time stamp right now and also tell you that well it's 11 10 sunday january 23rd our check-in was at uh 10 30 to 11. but we're really excited we're going in now and we're both hungry so we're probably gonna get some food mm -hmm. but we're gonna be doing okay i haven't cruised in two years and we're going to be just filming everything. We're going to be going to the most amazing places, doing some amazing excursions. We should have something for every port. Yes. At least something to do. Yes. Um, so, yay, yay to that. <laughs> and we're ready to leave. It's 47? Was that what it was? 47? It was 48 in Orlando. Oh, but you yeah, said it was yeah. a degree it's colder. So it's mean, pretty darn nippy out. But so we get through the first night. We're there you go. The open seas. Tomorrow's a sea day. We're seizing the day. Oh, heck yeah. And we get uh, nice <laughs> weather, hopefully. And we're going to be in the Caribbean where it's a lot warmer. Oh, I'm so degrees. excited. It's 11.41. Okay. It's been 31 minutes. We have only moved from right here. That's where we were. <laughs> in 31 minutes, but now we're moving. It's a little chilly out today. I'm a true Floridian. I've been here 12 years now. Five next month. Five. You're, you're getting there too. And remember you guys, before you go in there, you have to have your mask on. You have to have. You, I can't take the camera in there. You're not supposed to. Um, you have to have proof that you have negative COVID within the last two days, COVID test. You have to have, be fully uh, vaccinated within, what, 14 days of the sailing, the vaccination? Yes. And then you have to bring your vaccine card and your ID, obviously, like normal. 
Timestamp. 11.48. 11.48, we're going in, you guys. It's 12.08, you guys. I just saw this window, I thought it was cute. Look, carnival. That'd be a cute picture. We're doing the long walk to the ship. It is a long walk today. And I'm just hungry, but I'm super excited. And we're going straight to the food, I think. Whoa. There's the, she is. Oh my gosh, Amy, how long has it been? Uh, almost two years, and look, I've never seen her with her new paint. This is the third time I've been on this ship. The first one was very short, the second one was regular, and this one is six nights but it's always different. It's always fun. And thank you, Chris, for pulling my bag so I can film. <laughs> the paradise. Amy, are you excited? I'm so excited. All right. Two years. Two years. Two years. Two years too long. And how many more steps are we away from your first right there. cruise back? Oh my gosh. I don't know, 20, So 30. close. <laughs> so, so close. Excited. Are you? I am excited. This is gonna be awesome. I can't wait. I have not got to cruise with Amy in almost two years as well. So this is amazing. Look at the paradise. Oh my gosh. And oh we got so many fun surprises in store on this cruise. Oh my gosh. Two years too long. I'm getting ready to step on the ship. Oh my gosh! We're back! We are back! Oh, What's this? Oh. Oh, those are the cutest little cups. You can buy alcohol when you first come in. <laughs> Thank you. What's your number? Oh, no, no, no. I don't know. Thank you. That's cool, though. I know. It's awesome, though. That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> Just, how much are they? $14.95. This, this is a cool cup. You know what? This one. This we'll do one. one. one yeah. Three, five. <laughs> We're on the ship! Woohoo! Yes! I hope you guys are just as excited as we are. We're going to have the freaking time Oh my of our gosh. Lives. It's going to be so gonna be amazing. So Great food. Fun. Some Cheers. good drinks. Oh, we already started. That's Cheers. it. We're going to hop on the elevator. I'm going to go outside and take a picture of this baby at the cruise port with the carnival cruise ship in the background, the paradise. Mm -hmm. That would be a cool picture. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at, look at you, Chris. He's gone. Look at He's you. Nice. I'm just walking here holding my drink. No, Chris is really nice. He, he did that for me. Because I'm holding you guys in the other hand. I'm holding this in one hand and you guys in the other hand. So I have an important job. <laughs> okay. We're going to deck five. I have to say, uh, really pretty action on the ship. Isn't it? I love this ship. Like, pictures of it, I was kind of nervous. I was like, <sighs> Oh, it's going to be that green again off of the victory. <laughs> it's so, it's nice so and nicer. <laughs> look how clean. And here she is. Oh my God, we're going to have so much fun here, Chris. I'm ready for the parties, the fun, for the shopping, the eating, the exploring, the adventures that we have planned on ports. And you guys are coming with us the whole entire time. <laughs> 